Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to another vlog. So we're starting the vlog in the van because where are we going Caleb? Are we going on holiday? Yeah, we're going on holiday aren't we for the next couple of days? Yeah? Yeah, so we've just stopped at a fueling station. And now we're going to go to Aldi's, do a little shop for the next couple of days. We're staying in a caravan and we're staying at a park dean this time normally we stay, at, stay at havens but havens don't open up until like the middle of march park deans open up a little bit earlier so we decided to have a little park dean holiday for the next couple of days get away sorry about that guys the battery died and it's quite bright the sun but it is raining um i think sean said that it's raining for the next two days but we're not far because we're in a um, caravan so it's fine so we're staying at Caton Bay, which is a Park Dean holiday resort. So we're currently in Aldi's and they have a self-serve here in this Aldi's. That's absolutely crazy. I've never seen any self-serves before in Aldi's. So we've done up a shop and we're just waiting in the queue now. So this is what we've bought so far. Chris. Bread, pizzas, chicken, three chicken, and some veg and fruit and stuff. So we're back on the road again. Just finished up at Aldi's. We're having lunch on the road. <laughs> uh, so we had a sausage roll and some crisps. We went for these. They're supposed to be like Munster Munch, but they're called Munch, Munster Clothes. Um, but me and Sean were just saying that they taste pretty much the same as the branded ones. Just haven't got the fluff to them, have they? You know, like the Munster Munch got that big fluffy like flavour yeah, coating like around a, them. Yeah, like a crunch, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, they've got a nice coating around them as well, haven't they? Yeah. But they haven't, but the flavour's just the same. Flavour's just the same. With the price of crisps these days, you've got to be flipping rich to buy crisps now. <laughs> yeah, exactly, guys. For branded crisps, for Munster Munch, uh, you're talking about three pound, is it now? Yeah, for months and months, yeah, it's yeah. pretty expensive, yeah. But crisps are so expensive these days. Um, so we're looking, looking for alternatives, and these are pretty good, guys. And these were one twenty-five for, we found, uh, for um, twelve, is it? Three six nine for nine. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, nine. Yeah. It's yeah, for a nine. Buy, actually, that is a good buy. Yeah. Um, did you tell them what we found the alternative for Fanta for the red Fanta? Yeah, I mentioned that in a previous vlog, and a lot oh, of people right. were like, "Yeah, Stephanie, you're right. It's yes, exactly, exactly the same. same it? Yeah. it does, yeah, and it's sugar-free as well. Apparently, you know they are. Yeah. Man. Um, we're talking about this, guys. Yeah, it tastes exactly the same as like um, lemon Fanta. And did you know that Lilt? It's getting cancelled, they're not producing any more lilt, but Tango are like taking over kind of thing, yeah, they're making a flavour that's like lilt. Apparently Fanta owns lilt and they're selling the ingredients to Tango. Yeah, so if you like lilt, there will be no more lilt and you have to buy the Tango flavour which is like a pineapple. But yeah, interesting guys. <laughs> but these are really, really nice. Definitely try them out if you're in Aldi's. I would definitely recommend trying Aldi's out guys because the uh, prices of food nowadays, you can save yourself a fortune. That shop came up to just below 30 pound. I think it was like 28 pound. 20, yeah. Which will last us probably, probably about two, days. two, two or three days. And there might be some leftover like packets of us and packets like, of yeah. um, But we've got some really nice meals planned as well. So we're just making the drive to the caravan. We've got about 50 minutes left. There's a little bit of traffic and it is still raining. That's Stefan just picking up the keys. He's getting all the information pack, got the keys. <laughs> Passes, Brilliant. It's Let's get in. Oh. So wet, guys. Oh. What a great day to go away. Here we are, number 40, Ivory. Is that a local takeaway, was it? It was, yeah. <laughs> First time staying in the Park Dean caravan. Can you manage to get that kid? <laughs> it's very small. <laughs> Have a look. It's small, is it? It's small. Tell me what it is. Oh, it's a 
have a look. Oh, it'll do. It's not too oh, bad. Right? Might be a little small, but it's cosy. It's not bad. Let's put some lights on in here. It's not bad at all. Let's get, bring that into focus. It's not bad, Stephanie. Got a what little a sitting area here. Yeah, I mean, we've had bigger. Me so much when I used to go away with the family. With my family. <laughs> well, that's about the size, really. It's like that and it's just like small like that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got a nice little dining area here. We've got obviously a sitting area, which will sit everyone. We've got the TV. Um, much more you Put don't. The Put the cooker, cut the pots and pans. Um, microwave. microwave. Kettle Fridge, and toaster. Freezer. Fridge and freezer. And obviously some storage and stuff, which we'll get to show you later on. And then this is my biggest highlight. Plates and stuff. Let's have a little look. Not bad. Oh, it's not actually not too bad. It's quite big, that bathroom is, isn't it? Actually quite a big bathroom, that. And it's in here. Oh, there's another room for the kids. And then... Another one, just I think it's an, a replicate, and then over here, <laughs> oh, we have just get past. Well, this is actually quite a tight squeeze, actually. That's a double. This has got to be one of the smallest ones you've ever stayed in. I think so. Yeah, this is the smallest. This is the corridor here. It's just one person corridor. It's a one person <laughs> corridor, isn't it? Well, let's go and get the kids in and get some stuff in as well. Yeah. Um, so yeah. empty in the van. It hasn't got like parking on the caravan like you don't have your yeah. own drive do you basically yeah basically you don't have your own drive to park up and like unpack you have to park on like the main road kind of thing yeah. and then you just gotta walk well it's not like the main road it's basically it's like just i'll show you guys but let's go we'll show you hey have you got the keys for this place so what we was trying to explain before you park just down there so like, we're like three caravans away and then down that way there's about three caravans there so we're like dead on in the middle realistically us and that one there's like dead on in the middle and then you get like parking over here so with most ones that we've oh long time no see b fam it's been a while um but with most caravans parks that we stayed at we've always had like on-site parking so like basically you'd have our own little drive connected to the caravan but this is a new to us i've never done a park d1 before so i suppose we're getting used to new things as well but i was going to get the kids from the van um, as it was a little bit wet before, so we decided to stay in the van while we go and have a look and see if we can find it. But it's quite easy to locate. Um, yeah, the kids are super excited. Right, Caleb, yeah. you ready? Yeah. You, oh, the boys are already out. You guys are ready, I see, yeah? <laughs> right. Um, where is Khaleesi? Khaleesi had the journey in the back with Dion. Uh, in her high chair, high chair, car seat. Um, we have got quite a few things to unpack, so we're going to unpack some stuff and we'll catch you guys up inside the caravan. I'm taking over the flag now. Oh, What's up, guys? This is a live stream. This is our crib, homies. This is where we are right now. So you can tell. Look at this lovely lush room. TV, 4K definition. Yeah, she's so, you know, it'd be like that. Then this over here, you sit in an area, you're gonna sit down and eat some nom noms. <laughs> Ooh, pizza! So, this is the high wall <laughs> obstacle course that we've got. And then we keep walking up. Then we've got the outdoor seating area. Some Two TVs. Park right there. Yeah, there is a park right there. Yeah, a Looks park. like we've got like a little stage outside as well, yeah. and then some outdoor seating for the restaurant, and a nice sunny day. Some street eats, pizza box, another little bar there, a little park here. That's the restaurant, and then we've got the high wall. We've got the trampolines opposite the high ropes and then this is the second park for the older kids you've got scoops and then you've got like the craft hut over here where they do all the crafts and make a bear and pottery and everything like that you've got the Nissa shop and then this is the entertainment entrance
and then these are the arcades we've got the VR set another VR set Beat Hero the boat at restaurant so we've just literally got caught in a rainstorm guys I'm absolutely <laughs> <laughs> it's only like a two minute walk though. Just but, oh, the just rain start, just like, like five seconds off the shop. Yeah. Oh, We've got Khaleesi with our little yeah, harness good. thing on. Yeah, Khaleesi would love this. Yeah, don't show her. <laughs> wow. I know there's a lot of bubbles she'll love that, wouldn't she? now guys oh, and I've just okay. finished giving the caravan a nice clean down it was a little bit dirty in the bathroom I am gonna say that um, I don't usually give these kind of reviews but in all honesty didn't really think the toilet had been cleaned so I have cleaned all, all down the shower was nice and clean all of the surfaces were nice and clean and stuff um, yeah it's quite hygienic I think else felt quite hygienic it's just there's a few stains in the toilet that I wasn't too happy with I mean I'm a little bit like like the things be like nice and smart yeah. and tidy around the house you know that's my kind of personality um, so yeah, it's all looking good and um, I think Stephanie's just getting some pictures of the kids and stuff. I think Dion's made the decision to go and spend her money at the mini market up the road. Um, she wants to buy a couple of sweets because The Last of Us is on tonight. Are we watching The Last of Us tonight, are we? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I've got every, everything in my bag. I've got the projector and everything if you want to put on the projector. So excited to watch it. Um, but yeah, um, this TV doesn't come with like YouTube or internet or whatever. Like It's not a smart TV, it's just a basic standard TV. But I've got a device that I can plug into any TV that I come up to and it makes it into a smart TV like that so you can get like all of your apps and stuff, Netflix, Disney and it's all in HD as well so it doesn't matter what screen it is, it just produces the best quality. So we're going to put that together to the TV later on tonight. Uh, watch The Last of Us with Dion, she's got me addicted. Um, I've never thought I'd be interested, I watched the first episode and I thought oh, this is boring. I thought I'll give it another shot and I watched the second episode and I was like wow this is really good so if you're a Walking Dead fan you, you love it like it's one of them kind of things so we're currently just making tonight's tea so we're having like some stuffed peppers stuffed mushrooms some chicken flavored chicken um, and then we've got some new potatoes as well that we're cooking so it's gonna be absolutely delicious guys Diana's currently just helping me with the peppers and then Sean's just prepped the chicken for me. Honestly guys, trying to find peppers nowadays in the shop is a nightmare. Nobody, nowhere sells them. Um, but we did manage to find some in our local co-op the other day. We bought like a pack of six, was it Sean? Yeah, six, yeah. Pack of six for 170 So that wasn't too bad. Thanks Logan, darling. Um, but everywhere else has been sold out. But I think this is getting us prepared. Yeah. For our next surprise, the next thing that we want to be doing in our lives. Yeah, quite like this, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's like having this little space. Yeah, I know what you mean. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Without giving too much away to these guys, I think it's definitely like helping with like realize things, and then um, it's getting us excited as well as like making us think. Yeah, that would work actually. And the next thing that we want to do, but anyway, guys, that's a surprise. Whether it'll be happening 
late this year or early next year that we'll be telling you guys who knows we want to get a good use of what we've got at the moment don't we before we decide to do something else yeah yeah that's a hint 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 guys <laughs> that's very funny <laughs> Look like the pepper's going inside the pepper there. Yeah, it's all right there. Yes, I am a really good chef. I'm wiping the chicken. Yeah. But chicken. <laughs> so I'm currently making tonight's tea. And then Logan says, Mum, is that where all the rubbish goes in there? <laughs> Say something, guys, when you send things like you. Food looks rubbish. I'm not saying that, it's just because it's in a plastic bag. Because we're cooking it in a plastic bag, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> so this is what we're having in our stuffed peppers. The sun-dried tomato and our oregano. And then, in our stuffed mushrooms, we're having this spicy Mediterranean one. Yeah. When we went to the shops, uh -huh. I'm actually glad that we didn't do Big Shop. Yeah. Because the fridge and freezer is absolutely tiny. It is small, isn't it? Really small, guys. I've got my scarlet all over. I think it's a little bit bigger than the one we've got in the van. Yeah, I think it is. <laughs> <laughs> So it's a little bit later on and Stephanie has put out the most amazing meal ever guys. So simple and so easy to cook. And um, yeah, everyone sat around the table. And this is tonight's food guys. So we've got some chicken, some new potatoes, pepper, stuffed peppers, stuffed mushroom. So nice children. Mm -hmm. And there we have it. Didn't take long, but Khaleesi is know, I'm out. I'm Fast sure asleep. She's had a long day, hasn't she, Stephanie? She has. It's all new, isn't it, Khaleesi? Yeah, I think this is the first one that she's actually been able to like enjoy, like and run around kind of thing. I mean, she has run around others, but I think no, this... last time hopping, she was just calling. Yeah, she wasn't. She was running around furniture. She wasn't actually walking well, independently. Well, well, well. Yeah, that's right, isn't it? No. And Caleb, what do you think of the food? Very good. Are you good? You ate all your chicken. You're gonna have a go at your mushroom as well. Yeah, a little nibble. So the guys are taking the rubbish to the big bin outside. Yep. Thanks guys, see you in five. See you in five. <laughs> so just in case Stephanie hasn't ended the vlog, I'm just gonna put an end in on today's vlog. Uh, a big thank you to everybody who's watched our caravan review. It's our first day here at Caden Bay. And we'll get off and we'll catch you guys up in the next Batista family vlog. As always, be yourself guys, be different. Good night.